Welcome to my latest case, The Haunted Carousel. To start playing, choose either junior or senior detective. If you're new to adventure games or need some help, choose tutorial. Dear Ned, well, here I am at Captain's Cove Amusement Park, about to try to figure out what's behind all the weird things that have been happening here lately. First, a horse just disappeared off the carousel one night. Then, a little later, the carousel started spinning around all by itself in the dead of night, as if it was haunted or something. And then, last week, the roller coaster suddenly stopped in mid-ride for no apparent reason. Nobody was seriously hurt, but the park was shut down until the city knows for sure what caused the accident. I'm here because Paula Santos, the park's owner, is a friend of Dad's. She's putting me up at the Captain's Quarters Hotel, which is next to the park. I'm supposed to head over there right now and meet with a security guard named Harlan Bishop. I hope I don't let Paula down. Wish me luck. Ever yours, Nancy. P.S. There's a rumor going around that the park is cursed. Creepy, huh? A room service menu. All right. Will the young lady who just entered the park please turn immediately and enter the whale's mouth directly to her left? Thank you. Well, from the way you just marched right on in here past all those sorry we're closed signs, you're either who I think you are or you're one determined gatecrasher. If you think I'm Nancy Drew, you're right. That's a relief. It's too early in the day to go sick in the cops on anybody. I'm Harlan Bishop. Must be pretty boring around here with the park closed. Not really. In fact, I begged Miss Santos to keep me on while the park's closed. Even agreed to a pay cut. So you're not intimidated by all this cursed stuff? Somebody swiped the horse off a carousel and now it's malfunctioning. The police don't think it's that big a deal and frankly, neither do I. What about the roller coaster? Accidents happen. Of course, Ingrid will tell you that these so-called accidents are really the result of the park's karma getting bent out of shape by negative energy or some such gobbledygook. Who's Ingrid? Ingrid Corey. You'll probably meet her. She's working during the shutdown too. She's the park's chief engineer. Believes in all this wacky new age psychobiogenic stuff. Like if you eat food served by a waiter who's in a bad mood, you'll get scurvy or something. Where can I find her? First things first. You won't be meeting her or Elliot Chen, the park's art director, until after you go see the park's bookkeeper, Joy Trent. Miss Santos's orders. Joy pays all the bills so she knows pretty much everything that's going on. Plus, she'll give you an access card. Miss Santos wants you to have the run of the place. That would certainly help. Wait, hang on. I know Joy won't give you one of these, so I will. Here you go. It's a Captain's Cove fun card. Let's you ride the rides and play the games on the midway. Come back to me if you burn through that one and need another. Am I not supposed to have this? Well, see, Joy's just kind of joyless. It had never occurred to her that you might want to have some fun while you're here. Of course, she's a newbie too, like me. Maybe she'll come around. Anyway, here's a map of the park. I put an X where Joy's office is. What did you mean when you said you were a newbie? I've only worked here for a couple of weeks. I figured staying on while the park was closed would help me get up to speed on all the equipment and such. Where did you work before you came here? Oh, I worked in a store. Department store. You know, as a security guard. In Flemington. Not around here. I see you have a security camera trained on the carousel. Does that mean you got the theft of that carousel horse on tape? We didn't start monitoring the carousel until after the theft, but we do have one of those so-called hauntings on tape. Want to see it? That'd be great! I got the tape right here, all queued up. I played it for the police. Like I said before, they weren't real impressed. There's no sound, on the tape at least. The band organ started up when the carousel did, stayed on for about 30 seconds, then stopped. Have you tried to prove your screwed-up wiring theory? I ain't no cop. But now that you're here, maybe you can prove it for me. Did you notice that burst of static just before the carousel started to turn? Probably just a glitch in the tape. We use them over and over. I'll see you around. Have fun.
The phone number for the police. That might come in handy. Please don't open that. Sorry, bad habit. Hello? Hi, Nancy. It's Paula Santos. I was wondering when I'd hear from you. Have you been out to the park? Yes, I have. I forgot to tell you. All the rides are shut down except for the carousel. I thought you might need to see it in action. But please, take a good look at the roller coaster, even if you can't ride it. What did the police find when they looked at it? They looked around for five minutes, then left. Said as long as the insurance company was going to investigate, why should they? Well, I'll see what I can do, Miss Santos. I can't wait to hear what you turn up. Call me as often as you like. My phone's on and with me 24-7. Oh, and one more thing. Call me Paula. All right. Goodbye, Paula. Captain's Call Police Station. Would you hold, please? I'll try again later. Hello. Are you Nancy? Yes, I am. You're Joy? Joy Trent. Sorry about the mess. So, I'm supposed to give you an access card. No hurry. If you're in the middle of something, please, go ahead and finish up. That's okay. I just as soon get this little farce over. Excuse me? You're only here because it makes it look like Paula Santos had nothing to do with any of this curse garbage. Are you saying she did have something to do with it? I've seen how Paula runs the park. All she wants is to get more and more people through that gate. And what better way to do that than with a carousel that's allegedly haunted? But why would she sabotage the roller coaster? She can't make any money with a park shut down. She probably just didn't know the park would be shut down. Is Miss Santos aware of the way you feel about her? Of course not. I don't want to get fired. Besides, nobody's been hurt. Except that glorified con artist who claims his neck got injured, Lance Huffington. And the truth is, Paula offered me this job because she knew I needed the money. And I'm not entirely ungrateful. My father died recently. His estate is in bankruptcy. He used to be co-owner of the park. Two years ago, he suffered a huge financial setback, and he had to sell his share to Paula. When he died two months ago, he was flat broke. Paula could have bailed him out, but she didn't. Frankly, I think the reason she hired me was guilt. Right. Um, I'm supposed to get an access card from you? Here you go. That should get you into all the private areas of the park. But if you run into problems, don't come to me. Ask the chief engineer, Ingrid Corey. Her office is by the haunted house. The only other people in the park right now are Harlan Bishop and the art director, Elliot Chin. His studio is right by the treasure chest souvenir shop. But try not to bug him. Why? Is he temperamental? He's behind in his work and needs to catch up. Miss Santos has been getting on my case about it. Well, I think you have everything, so if you'll excuse me? Oh, right. Uh, thanks for all your help. Uh, sorry if I disturbed you. Okay if I peek in here? Go ahead and look around. Excuse all the clutter. I'm still trying to get this place organized. Uh hmm, looks like stenography. It's a memo about one of the carousel horses being sold. I wonder which horse. used to be a ballroom. How's that for irony? Hmm, maybe I should give Detective Paris a call. Hidden jewels? Maybe that's what whoever stole that carousel horse was after. Jewels from that heist. Looking for someone? If you're Ingrid Corey, not anymore. That's me. Ordinarily, I don't do the hands-on work, and I'd be able to shake your hand, Ms. I'm sorry, Drew. Nancy Drew. 
I'm helping Ms. Santos discover what's behind these carousel hauntings. Okay if I ask you some questions? Sure. Oh, my. You've got B3 issues. Okay. Vitamin B3. Niacin. The vibe you're giving off tells me you're low. Nothing that some natural peanut butter on a slice of whole wheat bread once a day won't fix. Harlan Bishop mentioned that some of your beliefs concerning food were somewhat unconventional. It just seems obvious to me that what you eat, as well as the psycho-spiritual conditions under which you eat it, results in what you are, that's all. Are you sure you're an engineer? Got a Bachelor of Science degree from Ohio State and everything. I like surprising people. Unpredictability is what makes life interesting. Miss Santos asked me to figure out why weird things have been happening around here lately. What's to figure out? Someone stole a horse off the carousel and now the park is cursed. Why would someone steal a carousel horse? Money. I hear they can be very valuable. Could I see the blueprints of the roller coaster so you can show me exactly where on the track it stopped? I've looked all over for those blueprints and can't find them anywhere. I'm sure one of the other engineers knows where they are, but I'm afraid I don't. Sorry. How well do you know Harlan Bishop? I know he's an ex-bouncer from Trenton. I also know it drives him nuts that this is one of the few places in the park he doesn't have a key for. Do you mind having to work during the shutdown? Not a bit. Keeping those card readers functioning is practically a full-time job all by itself. Plus, I happen to adore my job. Thanks for your help. You bet.